Osama bin Laden For most people, when they hear this name, they think negative stuff, a bad person. And today I want to talk to you about Omar bin Laden, his son, someone who is supposed to be Osama bin Laden's successor. So where is he now? Who did he become? And is he as bad as Osama bin Laden? Well, for starters, we need to go back in time and see what was his childhood like. As a child, he had no toys, he was not allowed to smile too wildly, and most crazily, he was trained by Al-Qaeda to become a terrorist. They would kill his empathy by killing his pets with poisonous gas, so the child sees the suffering from a very young age. There were many of these situations that were meant to make this child into the next Al-Qaeda leader. But the reason why I sit here in front of you today is because Omar very early on decided that he doesn't want to be like his father. Despite an insanely toxic, difficult, violent environment, he didn't allow it to influence him. Today, Omar is an artist. He is an advocate for peace. And he became the absolute opposite of Osama bin Laden. The reason why I talk to you about this today is because when I heard this story I realized how strongly, how deeply it resonates with me. It's not easy to open up about these things, but I can tell you that for most of my life I decided that I cannot end up like my father. Ever since I was a really young child, I decided that I need to become the exact opposite. Because I saw how his life was falling apart away from me because he was never present. But I would see that he was building his life on lies. He was building his life by stealing from people. He was building his life with many women and many very meaningless relationships. Cheating on his partners, never being there present for his children because I'm one of the many kids. All the way until 21 years old, I was never in any relationship. I have promised myself that I will not even take the risk. While having a father like this, what if I start meeting girls, dating them, and then I'm going to become just like him? I'm gonna cheat on them, I'm going to have many meaningless relationships, even worse, I will have an unwanted child and my whole life will be ruined. Very early on in my life, I have said to myself that I will not end up like my father. Fast forward to now, Looking back at all these decisions and looking at who I became today, I can truly tell you, just like Omar, Osama bin Laden's son, I myself have become the absolute opposite of my father. If you think that you have it in your genes, if you think that all these bad examples you grew up with the toxic environment you have been a part of. If you think this is strongly in you and you have to become that person, I promise you that you don't have to. People say the best way to learn is by making mistakes. But I will take it a step forward, especially when it comes to our own family. The best way to learn is by learning from other people's mistakes. If Osama bin Laden's son ended up to be a peace advocate, anyone can do it. And deep down inside you know it. And I just wanted to share this story with you today to make sure that there's more good people in the world who follow their heart and become the opposites.